Hey everyone, welcome. I am here with Miss Lynn Gray and she has come to talk to us today about something she is very passionate about and also something she's very talented doing. So, yeah. <laughs> why don't you show us uh, some of your artwork? Okay, we're going to be talking about Know It Today and the art. Okay. And I did this for school. Uh-huh. And then I drew some little hearts. You drew some hearts. So what, why the rainbow? What, did, what does the rainbow have to do with? It represents for us not, like for our sin. Oh, God's promise of taking away our sins. That is so true. It is beautiful. Thanks. Wow. And then you added glitter to it and everything. Well, my mom had to help. <laughs> well, that's okay. Sometimes we need help with glitter. It could go everywhere. Yeah. It, it's still in the table. Really? <laughs> so tell me, why, so you said you want to talk about Noah? Yeah. So what? Noah and the ark and the rainbow and everything. Yeah. So um, what else was on the ark? I mean, can you tell me the story about Noah? Well, Noah, everybody wouldn't trust him. Mm -hmm. Is it because... Him and his family was the only ones who believed in, in God and mm -hmm. Jesus. And so God said he would make a flood so, to tell uh, Noah mm -hmm. to build an ark. Wow. And so then when he found, he asked the dove to find, he took the dove mm -hmm. and sent him to find land. Mm -hmm. And then when they found land, well, when the dove found land, they, it led, it led uh -huh. the ship to where it is, and and then the rainbow, and then wow. God sent the rainbow. Wow! So the rainbow represents the promise that God would never flood the earth again. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. That's a pretty big promise. Yeah. So do you see rainbows still? Yeah. Wow. So show me what else. That, oh, you drew something. Here, I'll hold this. I you just painted the ark. Yeah. I I just made this today. Whoa. First thing when I got up, and I used my only canvas. <laughs> I used all of them. And it is the, them heading towards the land to for the rainbow. And I put some glitter. That. that is and so beautiful. There's a little pot with the... A flower on top. That's very creative. For land. It was the bird who brought the land. But to, yes, to let them know that there was dry land. There's a little dry. Oh, that's great. <laughs> so tell me, Lennon, how did you get started in artwork? Why, what made you so creative? Well, my dad... Uh -huh. Um, he's so creative, uh -huh. and he even made my mom a picture. Wow. It looked the exact thing as my mom wanted it. We just had to buy a picture frame. That is so awesome. You know, I was reading this past week because I was thinking about talking to you, and I'm like, I'm so glad that there are creative kids out there who will do art and express themselves because, you know, the first verse in the Bible, you know what it says? What? In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Yeah. So when you're creative, you represent a character and nature of God. Mm -hmm. That is so awesome. And what made me think about this is, like, I thought since the rainbow has always came back, uh -huh. we should, like, always make pictures about it and, like, and stuff like that yeah. so it represents uh -huh. the rainbow that god made the for the promise right i love that that is so mm -hmm. good we were reminded of the promise every yeah. time we see a rainbow yeah what promise is that good like what's the promise you think i think the promise was for us sins mm -hmm. to wash that he will always wash our hearts. That is so true. He will always wash our hearts. I love that so much. 
well, you, would you do me a favor? Would you pray for us and the li- people who will be watching this video that they would realize that God has a promise for their life too? Would you do that? Sure. Okay. I'm going to put that right here so people can see it. Yeah. All right. You go ahead and leave us in prayer, and then I'll pray after you. Okay. Okay. Lord, thank you for making us, and thank you for um, making the whole world for us. If you didn't send your son down to die for us, we'd, we'd be sin and die in hell. So, Father, thank you so much for the promise of Jesus, and thank you so much for the promise of your love for us. And I just thank you for Lennon, and I just bless her life. I thank you that she is so creative, and she represents you so well. I just pray that you give her many more opportunities to share your love with everyone she comes in contact with. In Jesus' name, amen. I actually have one more thing to talk about. Okay, what is it? It is this picture right here. Oh, we forgot that one. Yep. And there's the flower. It was purple, but now it's pink. Whoa, that is awesome. Let's show that one too. And he came, and there's a little green right there, but, and he came. Oh, well thank you so much for coming and showing us all this.